Yo. What's up, everybody? Rage Cage 20 you're back with another Nightwish Live battle. Today, we have a very interesting adventure here. We're in the last two of our live battles, but before we get into that, of course, I have to start out with the rules and regulations just so everybody knows. Fair warning, as we've done in the other ones. Have you seen the other ones? <clears throat> uh, remember to keep it constructive and or positive in the comments. Any kind of toxicity insults, name-calling, etc. will get you blocked from the channel immediately. You have been warned. Uh, the reason we are doing this is not just to say one singer is better than the other. The reason we are doing this is to come back to the song at the end of the day. If I had to listen to either of these versions of the song, uh, this song again, which one would I choose? That is all we're doing. And of course at the very end of this, at the end of the next video, I'm going to decide who my favorite Nightwish live singer is and announce who my favorite Nightwish studio singer is so come check that out at the end of the next one if you're even interested also this is not going to really be an analysis we're just going to check out what i like about the way the beach singer is doing this song and of course the original singer has home field advantage and gets to go first as always so today we have poet and the pendulum oh it's gonna be interesting so the net version, we're going live at Wacken Open Air 20, 2018, 2008. Uh, I don't know why I went with 20 right out the gate, but yeah. 2008. Uh, and, of course, uh, the Nightwish version is uh, from Wembley, Vehicle Spirit 2015. Uh, there's another one that says 2016, but I think it's taken from the same... It's from the sa same location, so I feel like that's wrong date but i don't know honestly they might have done it come back and done it 2016 no idea we're gonna do the 2015 one ah, that's just what's gonna happen so this song in general as i mentioned at the end of the last live battle if you check caught that is gonna be a little hard for me because this is oh this is nemo and well it better not be nemo and i'm gonna be a little, a little interesting the nemo. It, anyways we'll find out well you don't have to worry about that uh, this one's going to be a little interesting for me because Poet and the Pendulum is my favorite Nightwish song of all time. Don't know why, just every time I heard it, it was just a beautiful masterpiece to me. And I just fell in love with it. So, what we're going to need to do is try to get past how much I love the studio version and just listen, just bring it down, break it down to... How was it performed by each singer? Live, we need to focus in on that. That is the important part. So, we gotta see what happens with that. Well, I'll do my absolute best to keep it neutral and all that. But, uh, you know, I'm only human, so we'll see what happens. I think I know what's gonna happen, but we're not gonna jump the gun yet. So, Net, you're up. Homefield Vanish, you're up. You up first. Take the stage. Again, as always, I don't want a clean fight. I want this to be filthy in a good way. I want you to bust out every tool you got in your arsenal and just give me that good good. So it says Nemo Ampo in the pendulum, so we'll have to figure out what the fuck that means. Uh, it's 15 minutes, so I don't think you can put both songs in there because Nemo's not a 2-3 to three minute song. So I don't fucking know, but we'll find out together. Let's see which one starts out. Like. Woo! So people, walk in. You know this one that we are gonna do now. So why don't you sing along a little bit? But not now. Please, Maestro, give us, give us the little beginning. Sounds like it's gonna be Nemo. Yep, that'd be Nemo. Okay. So it seems like they might have a shortened version of Poet and the Pendulum by at least around a minute or two. Interesting. That could affect the outcome here. Empo on guitars. Yep, yep. There we go. That's the right song. Yeah. 
our maestro over here, Tuomas, an extra big hand. I know he needs it today. Big hand! Okay, so that was a little weird. <sighs> I guess I'll clear myself out. I know what I'm doing anyways. Uh, I need to go find the other version now as well. Uh, the, we know what you're looking for here. Uh, so... Which one was it? Both of the thieves, right? That might not have been the best. Okay. Well, either will work. I don't know. I'm going to cut this part out. There we go. You and you. I need you too. Okay. <laughs> Fuck. That's all out. That scares me every time. Alright. Back in here. Back in here. Alright. So. You have to stay tuned if you want to know what this is and what I'm talking about. But so far, it's going exactly as I thought it would. There's part of it that is like I had a feeling. The other part of it is up in the air. The part that's up in the air, it's not looking. It's it's, it's making me nervous. But, but we'll see what happens. You never know. You never fucking know. Anyways. Pretty decent uh, showing here from Net. We need to skip uh, Nemo. <laughs> uh, boop. Jump around here. So this part, I don't know who's singing. <laughs> like, I know it's supposed to be Annette. I don't know if Annette's actually singing it or if it's going through the speakers. Speaking of which, uh, the parts that have Marco singing in it uh, we're going to ignore uh, those parts kind of uh, I might after listening to be like I kind of like the way Marco singing in this one better but that's not going to affect the outcome of this of, of which version I want to listen to again by any means um, so just putting that one out there but uh yeah, I don't know who's singing. I don't think it's Annette actually singing it. Um, I think she can, but I don't think she did. <laughs> because uh, all the other parts where she was supposed to go high, but a lot of the time she did it. So there's that. Uh, but uh, let's listen to that. There's parts in it that make me think that it's being actually sung, but they, you nev they never show her, so I'm guessing not. That right there. That uh, wasn't, I don't think it was in. I'm pretty positive. I've never heard it in the original <clears throat> in the studio. So it makes me feel like someone's actually singing that part. Or it was at least pre-recorded before they did this tour. No idea. <laughs> but at least, you know, it sounds nice. It sounds really good. Anyways, we're going to jump ahead here around 720. Get to the uh, to the opening verse here. Go through it a little bit, pick it apart a little bit. Starting out very beautiful, very, very kind of open. I like I like what I'm hearing so far. We don't ride apart, but so Again, I, I like that part where it kind of jumps up. Again, to that kind of more sharper Annette singing. I, I, I like that she did it. I was afraid she wasn't going to do it. She does have a little break in there. That's a little interesting. But not discrediting. It's just like a tiny little tiny little bump. But uh, still, really like what I'm hearing. I don't know if I need the little nah in there. 
take it to leave it. I don't say it, it, it was. I won't say it was a bump. I don't say it ruined anything. But you know, take it to leave it kind of situation. <clears throat> However, every time when we done this kind of the chorus part of the song, it's not necessarily because I don't mean, know how how long the song is and how it changes up. I don't know if you can necessarily call it a chorus, but it's the only part that repeats at least three times, if I remember correctly, throughout the song. Um, so we'll call it a chorus. Uh, but yeah, during the chorus, the chorus to me sounded a, l- a little nasally at parts. It, it sounded a little, you know, it, it never was really fully like there. Yes, sold it. It was never bad. There was even some good, open, beautiful singing in it, but it was never completely there for me every time it happened. That's beautiful right there. Right you know, it gives it a little, a little bit nasally on it, like a little bit of a, a little bit of a, you know, nothing not like, Nothing was like, oh, but you know, like a little bit of it's just like uh, the tonality is, it's like there, but it's, it, it feels a little nasally to me for sure. <laughs> little, little rush in the, no, kind of drop off there. Yeah, that that chorus there every time was 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 a, was a little bit rough. It wasn't bad by any means. I still liked it, but it just it wasn't like, mm, you know, it wasn't mwah, you know what I mean? It was just it, there was a little shakiness to it, but still not bad, not bad. Uh, around eight forty here. Uh, I feel like I'm gonna know what I mean by this. I said, uh, is this emotion? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's some emotion, but she definitely showing some emotion, but I could use some more. I could definitely use some more emotion in this being sung here. Uh, and swing notes. Not exactly sure what I meant by that, but we'll find out together. Right there, you can see she's giving it a little motion. She's getting into it, but like, I could use more. You know what I mean? I could use some more. Ah. Yeah, that little swing there that she did last time too. Take me and that, I love that. Duh. That was done beautifully. That was done really beautifully. I like that. I like that. Uh, jumping another minute here around, we'll go around 10 ish minutes in. So, this section here. She, as I was mentioning at the beginning, you know, when she, there, was, there was all that stuff and she was singing, like, I feel like it might have been pre-recorded because she didn't do any of the other high notes in the song. This part, which is supposed to be very high, she she, she did not jump up to the high register at all. She, she kept it really low here, which it sounds very beautiful and warm and, and, and just, just nice. But at the same time, it's like I really wanted to be impressed and blown away by those high notes. So... First note. It's knocked down. At least So again, very beautiful, very soft, very warm, very open. But you know, it's not the high notes. So I mean, could come back to bite her, or she could be fine with it. We'll find out later. Uh, but just 
something to note. Like, again, still liked it. It's just like I was really wanted to be blown away by that, just that fucking octave or two. I think it's just an octave, but it's really high. So uh, I wanted to be blown away by those high notes, and I just I didn't get it. Uh, and around 11 here, this is kind not necessarily on her, on the net. But I'm kind of missing the fullness of the double voice that I'm used to hearing at this part. And it didn't really sing true for me. I'm used to it being kind of a little bit more soft and round like she was doing before. Uh, with that double voice in there, it just kind of gives it this fullness to it, and I'm not really getting that fullness. That's not necessarily on her. That's kind of they just didn't put the harmony through the speakers like they've done other parts in the song. So, uh, so I don't know if we can necessarily count that against her, but if Floor has it, then it's, it's probably going to shine a little bit stronger. So you know, we'll, we'll see what happens with that. Uh, but the notes. Nice sign, beautiful. The singing's nice. The singing's really good. Um, Eleven forty-five is just is a minor thing. Um, this this has nothing to do with the singing of either of these people because I'm pretty sure both of them do it. They put the poetry through the speakers. Uh, I mean that's okay because it's supposed to be a different voice. I would have really liked to hear Annette say these things, but. It's not a big deal. That's that's give or take. It's that's whatever. So that doesn't count against her for. Uh, though Floor does speak it, which I don't think she does. I, I, I I've heard it, but like I, Floor's version. But like that was a long time ago, and I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> so you know, but I don't think it does. Um, thirteen fifty. We have to go here and then just start skipping. <laughs> There we go. Uh, 1350, I said slightly, um, slightly nasally here. Let's see. Here. I was wrong on the time. There we go. Yeah, a little bit of nasal in there, almost like she may have had a cold or something. Like it's just a little bit nasally, uh, but uh, I mean, not horrible. But just uh, this one was that one was a little rough. That part was really nice. That part was really nice. I like that. And then switching to the other song now. <laughs> the other the other continued because I don't know why it got caught off there. But what are you going to do? Uh, there we go. Uh, 11 minutes in. Now we're going back in time, but technically forward in time. It's fascinating how this is working right now. Uh, we'll go around here. Um, so I really wanted to hear this ending part because it's supposed to be beautiful, like crystal high singing, like sounds like crystals, so high pitched, you know what I mean? Just very beautiful, very smooth. And, uh, the first mark I have here is woof, because <laughs> it did not, like at first it came out like, you know, maybe I, maybe I should have just let it in there, but she does turn around in a minute here, but this first part I remember like, woo, mm -hmm. I like the acting that she's got going on here, just the, just kind of falling in within herself, and then, yeah, it's very beautiful, Good done. Okay, yeah, a little rough, let her keep going. Uh, alright, alright, alright. Okay, yeah. 
All right. I. Wait, this is not like... Yeah, no, 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 keep going. Um, uh, so that part, a little rough. Now, that's a very easily beatable section. However, right here, I put, fuck yeah. Like, what was supposed to happen? She then turned it on here. Like, very close to the studio version. The, the very beautiful, emotional, passionate belting in here. Fuck yeah. She turned it on at this point right here. Yeah! Even lets her voice break there at the end. Very nice. Maybe intentional, maybe not. I don't know. Don't know if I necessarily needed those extra notes, but you know, I, I won't hold it against her. Again, I kind of wish she would just kept the belting going through the whole way. I, the, you know, these kind of extra little embellishments and stuff, I don't think is necessary. I noticed uh, Net seems to, from what I've heard so far, seems to do that kind of a lot in her songs, uh, in, her, in her live versions of songs. And I just like, I don't know, I, I, I don't really need them. But then again, they're not like bad. So it's like, uh, you know, I don't know if that's just me or not. And then the rest, you know, okay. There's no more singing. Yeah. That um that was good. I there's there's bits about it that I like I really, really like. There's there's bits about it that's like very beatable. So let's see if it gets beaten or not, shall we? Alright. Switching over to floor here. Lore, you're up. You have the stage. Blow my mind. Let's see what happens.
I'm afraid, so afraid, being raped again and again and again. I know I will die alone, but loved. You live long enough to hear the sound of guns.
sound good. <clears throat> Sorry for the hacking and coughing. We're not there at the end. Uh, we will go back through this immediately. I just need to cut, do listen to something real fast. Just check if there's a difference between this version and the next version, and you know what, 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 what have you. Uh, yeah, sorry, uh, right, right, right in between, right before I listened to this version, I took a sip of water and it inhaled it, so I was, uh, spending a little bit of time hack, trying to hack water out of my lungs, and there was just the residual coming up, so sorry if you could hear that. Anyways. Alright, it's the same recording. Uh, but I actually think this one has better quality than that one too, so we picked a good one. Uh, awesome. Uh, okay, uh, coming back in here, going back through this, um, I will say right out of the gate, because this stuff has nothing to do with what the outcome is going to be, but I do like the uh, the, the, the instrumentation and uh, Marco singing more on this recording than on the in recordings. Uh, I, I'm not, yeah, I, I think, I, I think like, it's very, very similar at first. I was just like, yeah, I'm really liking the instrumentation on the, on the net version. This one, I just kind of like the, the addition of the, some extra distortion in there on the guitars in certain parts. So, yeah, side note. Uh, not important. Uh, so the beginning here, obviously, on both of these, it sounds like both the, uh, the, the beginning parts were pre-recorded um, and they were pretty similar and whatnot through part through part one here uh so what the, the, oh yeah <laughs> that's right i'm gonna let you, uh, i'm gonna be deciding this as we go along here because uh, this one's a lot closer than i thought it was going to be at different points um so i'm literally going to be going step by step here on some of the um some of the sim the similarities in doing little things here don't mind me but yeah that's it's, it's just a, it's a wash on the beginning you know both pretty equal pre-recorded both sounds very similar if it's not if it's not the same i don't think it's the same but both very similar both very beautiful we're giving that giving that a free wash here we're gonna go to two minutes in and get the uh the first verse and chorus just like we did on the other one um and just kind of feel it out here feel it out how i felt about this Uh, we're just gonna take that section there. Um, there were parts in there that I really liked. There are parts in there that are really nicely done. Uh, there were some changes up, just like small changes, and then some major changes up of you know from studio version to this. That uh, some of them was just like, oh yeah, I really like that, and some of them were kind of like the like the the, the Nemo. Uh, Tarja to a net thing to where it's like some of the changes felt a little weird, felt a little off to me. Uh, so, you know, if we're going to call it on that one, we got to call it on this one, uh, just to be fair. So let's, let's, let's go through some of those. Pretty good so far. Yeah, very smooth, very nice. I like what I'm hearing. We don't try to talk. I like that. Oh, very nice, very beautiful. I kind of, I, I think it's a little bit of the drawn out song, kind of the way she holds it out a little bit longer. Is like, it's like, you know, it's not really, it's not really stronger, but it's not necessarily weaker for me. It's just, it's just okay. And this growl here is, I, I think this growl is appropriate uh, for the words that are being said. I, I, I don't mind the growl too much that's coming up. Still the same old song. 
same old song. Like that change a little bit. It's just, uh, you know, it's again, it's not like, yeah, but it's not like, eh, it's like, eh, it's, it's, it's okay. Like that, okay. that note there? Check, let me check that note there. This part is nice though. I like the da that we got in there. So the, again, there's like parts is like, oh yeah, 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 really nice. And this parts is like, hmm, you know, it's, like, it's, 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 it's a back and forth there. Uh, I'm gonna where I, I need to find over this. Uh, uh, oh, that's supposed to. How do you do that? Uh, yeah, we're just that. All right, let's listen to this chorus here. Let's listen to this chorus. That right off the gate, da da. It's again, that's another addition to embellishment that like it doesn't necessarily feel out of place, but doesn't feel like yeah, that needed to be there. It's a little okay, okay. Yeah, I think this 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 chorus uh, in this song is just hard to sing in general. I think it is. I think just the kind of the the fast nature of this section uh, of uh, uh, just of this this whole part just kind of makes that end just kind of feel rushed. Um, so that's kind of a wash on both sides. Um, it just it just it. I, I don't feel like it really came out the way I was looking for on either side here so I think this is kind of a it's kind of a kind of a wash uh so we'll give that a, a yeah that'd be right here uh you know it just kind of a you know it, it just it seems like a hard course to do in general I don't think it was done like mm, like mm, beautiful on, on either side here again I don't really need that extra jump interval there it just feels out it feels weird to me i don't know that's nice though. that's really nice all right moving along here uh, i gotta find where i am okay uh 340 this one's i think a, this one wasn't marked on the other one i put the the, uh, the the line take me home can't remember what happened on it but we're gonna listen to it again and find out nice it was good okay positive positive yeah no that was i'm gonna hear it again here but that was that was like spot on that was really nice That was that was clean. That was clean, clean, clean. All right. Um, oh, good. That's something else. Okay. I was like, I found where. There we are. Uh, Four nineteen ish here. Um, we have we we have a we have a boon here for four. She hit the high notes. But I want to. I want to check them again, but yeah, she she hit the high notes, which is right out the gate. Good, <laughs> good. I was missing that in the other one. I wanted to hear those high notes, and I got to hear those high notes in here. That's a good. Yeah, jump a little ahead here because my time, my time's dead. Oh, 49. That looks like a 19. There we go. That that 
The ending there didn't feel as super strong. The notes, let me, let me hear that again. I was not even ready to be paying attention to that. Uh, there was a big pause in there too. I think it sounded intentional, but I don't know how I'm feeling about that. That's, hmm, yeah, interesting. Um, so moving further here around 550 i love that the high notes were in there there was uh, the end felt a little weird but still the, the positive that the high notes were in fact in there that's good uh that's really good here um 550 i said it was more full than what i remember hearing from annette but i wanted to check it again i want to check this again so let's listen to this Yeah, right out the gate, first off, you have the double voice, which is good. And just immediately that open tone, oh, just very round. It's got that, just that, that right pitch that I'm looking for. Just very great start. But I put check for a reason here. So let's let it keep rolling out. The ending is not, the ending is not bad, I would say. Um, it, it, it again is a little bit not necessarily what I you know what I'm looking for, but like at the same time it was it wasn't like ooh that didn't need to be there, so you know it's fine. I don't know why that just flashed. That's weird. Uh, so yeah, I got that. Uh, but we got that. That, but that, that, but that. Got it. <laughs> uh, around now, jumping forward here, 850, however, the same. God, that's a huge jump, but that's right. No, that's correct. Um, same thing with. Um, same thing marked on. Uh, with Annette. I could have used more fullness here. Uh, and the ending. Something about the ending. But yeah, I, I kind of. Yeah, I kind of needed a little bit more of that richness and fullness in here, and I don't think I got it. But let's listen again. I could be wrong. Yeah, all of that. That's, that's a little, uh... It doesn't have that... Dun, 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 just kind of openness that I'm kind of looking for. It feels... Was, I, I want to say all over the place, but let me let me hear again. Let me really focus here. I, I got distracted by Marco being just awesome. The ending was good though. The ending was good though. Yeah. Yeah, hmm. I like the extra aggression, especially for the words being used there, uh, and just kind of mimicking how it is in the studio version. But the 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 whole section before the ending of that was was a little shaky. It was a little shaky for me. I'm not sure. Anyways, now nine thirty, we have held. I said held here. Uh, let's find out. I think that she held out a note. I thought it was really good. Okay. Let's re recall that here. Yeah, I like that. Nice vibrato, nice open held note there. Very beautiful. Very beautiful. Um, yeah, we'll get that. Uh, boop, boop. Uh, 11.15 here. Ooh, oh, I'm running, I'm running out of room. Jump, jump, jump. There we go. Um, I said, you know, the higher notes. She went for the higher notes and no woof. There's no woof on this one. So that's good. <laughs> definitely, definitely good. There was no woof like there was on the nets. <laughs> Shake, little shake there, but 
brought it back, brought it back. There you go, very good. out for there clean ass out for there like that uh, pop um, however this this part we you know when we had the fuck yeah turn on uh, boom 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 that's wash okay cool got that all marked out um, this part was was not as belted and as as kind of emotional as I was looking for which I was surprised because I was like oh here she goes she's gonna just fucking drop it and I didn't get that drop here but again I always could be wrong you know I miss stuff sometimes let me let me hear it again let me let me see let me see if uh if we that's all wrong Don't get me wrong, she's starting out beautiful here. It's like she she's giving it air, she's giving it energy, but I'm looking for like a step above. I feel like that popped it a step above. Just, it's like a step away from just like being at the same level. It's clean. It's beautiful. Don't get me wrong. Just I'm looking for that. Just that passion. Just yeah. And I'm, I'm just not quite there for me. Oh, that's not bad. That's not bad. And we're about to get. To Yeah, it kind of, uh, kind of like how Ned does sometimes. I don't know if I needed those extra notes, so that's kind of a wash there. But yeah, there was that that I was a little off on that one, but I did really like this held note she had in here. That's pretty. That's beautiful. I can't. I can't deny that. That's gorgeous right there. That's some gorgeous shit right there. And then around thirteen ten, uh, so some really high, nice high notes here at the end. Yeah, because I think in the, in the nest, this was just put through the speaker like I expected it to. But she, she actually, she actually popped these. So let's hear it. Crystal clean and clear, pure, very, very close to the studio, like pretty much the studio version right here, coming from her, very nice, loving it, loving it. What I gotta do here, because this was a lot closer than I thought it was going to be. Um, I need to take a moment to deliberate, and I will be right back. Wow. That was actually, going through the numbers here and everything that I was doing, that was actually insanely close. That was way closer than I thought that this was going to be. Uh, I was absolutely 100% correct in my assumption because I know me and so I, I knew so now we can unfold that um, if I had to choose between either of these live or the studio version I would 100% choose a net studio version over either of these live ones to me that just still is just like a gem like just perfect so beautiful and amazing I love a net's version of it when uh, even better when it's not live. Just want to put that one out there. That's exactly what I knew was probably going to happen, and I was right. 
Um, though both of them actually got really close to being like right there. And that was surprising to me. And they were both really close to each other. I thought one of them was going to take the other one by storm. Um, and I was su- surprised <laughs> that it was, it was not that case. It was literally almost point for point exactly the same in both positive and negative like it was almost exactly a tie but f- unfortunately one person has a slight advantage a fucking sliver of a slight advantage here this was actually a lot closer than I thought it was going to be at the end of the day if I had to listen to one of these versions live again between Annette and Floor who would I choose who had the edge? Who would I listen to again? Got to give it to Floor. Um, <laughs> Floor had a slight edge. And I mean, it was fucking close. Literally. Literally, it was just the high notes. Like, out of all the positives, when we got to the to the end, it was literally the high notes that pushed her over. Because uh, there was parts that was just like, oh, Annette's got the advantage here. Floor, there was a little weird here. But then at this part, it was a little weird here from Net, and Floor really did amazing on it. It went back and forth throughout the entire song. But I think it was those high notes, especially at the end, that just gave Floor that slight advantage that had her win this for me. Honestly, it was very close. There was... I would say that I, I definitely got a little bit more uh, throughout, I'd say throughout the entirety of the song, I got more emotion from Floor and there was parts from Annette that I was kind of looking for more emotion. However, at the end, I feel like I was getting more emotion from Annette, oddly enough, and I was looking for a little bit more from, from Floor. It was interesting how back and forth this one went for me, but at the end of the day, I gotta give it to the studio version, but if we had to go to a live version, I would absolutely listen to Floors again over Annette's. So, wow. <sighs> I did not see that one coming. But that was fun, actually. I'm sure a lot of people did not find some of the things I said fun. Uh, I mean, you've been warned at the beginning, so, you know, I'm not gonna warn you again. Um, but I don't know. I hope you found that as entertaining as I did. Um, that was. Oh, wow. Fascinating. Anyways, we got one, count it, uno, left. One left. This one I'm not even going to tell you who's between because it's a mystery. It's a surprise. It is a fantabulous surprise. But, um, yeah, before this one, everyone was tied at one up, one down. I mean... And now who, now who knows how it's going to go on the next one? Uh, this next one could go, it could be interesting. And it's also, well, I can't tell you that. That's going to it'll spoil some, it'll spoil it. But it's going to be fascinating to see how this all ends out. So, oh, by the way, before I finish this off, whoever wins the most isn't going to determine who my favorite is live singer is i already pretty positive i know the answer to that I, the next one will confirm it but I, I already know so it doesn't matter who comes out more on top than the other uh it's not gonna change i don't think it's gonna change my mind that that, that doesn't determine who my favorite live singer is of Nightwish, or who my favorite uh studio singer is it's arbitrary numbers it's just fun facts i just thought i'd put that out that everyone was one for one until this one Anyways, if you enjoyed this, make sure you come back for the thrilling-ish, maybe, for some people, uh, conclusion of these live battles next time. I'll see you then.